Hey, what's going on guys? Just wanted to do a quick video today showing you the differences between fiber and cable modem. Um, right now I currently have the CenturyLink fiber, which is the basically the one gigabyte per second, and that is $65 a month for a lifetime. Uh, before that, I had a Charter Spectrum. I was paying $70 for 400 megabytes per second and 20 megabytes per second upload. And right now with CenturyLink, I'm paying $65 a month for one gigabyte both ways, which is fiber. So I kept both for a little while to see the real differences on the speed test and everything. Ultimately, I'm, of course, I'm gonna get rid of this cable modem, which I'm probably gonna do tomorrow, but I wanted, before I got rid of it, I wanted to show you guys the speed difference and also show you the difference in cables. Uh, some of these tests, I was using a Cat 5E Ethernet cable, and then the, the fiber one I bought, a Cat 7 cable. And I'm gonna show you the differences in speed between the two, and then also between the two cables on both systems. So, just wanted to show you what I had real quick. Um, this here is the CenturyLink fiber, as you can see. I have that white cable is going straight up to my computer where I did the speed test. And then that yellow cable is connected to my Google Wi-Fi, which, you know, sends Wi-Fi throughout the whole house. And this one also has 5G, which is a much quicker Wi-Fi signal compared to this charter one, which is just the standard. I believe it's 2.4. Anyways, I'm going to show you some speed tests now. And uh, let me know what you think in the end. Let me know what service you currently have, if you plan on upgrading, or if you can even get fiber in your area. Uh, I just moved a few months back, and I was lucky enough to have my new subdivision have fiber. So that's pretty cool. Uh, my last subdivision, I could not get it at all. So. All right, here comes the speed test. Thanks. All right, we're going to start with the CenturyLink fiber using the category 5E Ethernet cable. So you can see right off the bat, it's not performing very well. Um, it can't even bust over 100 megabytes per second. And this is supposed to be one gigabytes per second, basically. Um, as you can see, shortly following this, uh, the category 7 just absolutely blows it out of the water. All right, now we're moving on to the Category 7 Ethernet cable. I picked this up for like $12 on Amazon, and it's a 25-foot length, or 20, one of the two. And as you can see, it just absolutely dominates the 5E.
All right, now we're moving on to Charter Spectrum. Uh, this first test is with the CAT7 Ethernet cable. And this is about what I expected from it. I'm paying for 400 mega, megabytes per second down and 20 megabytes, megabytes per second up. So this test is perfectly fine. With the CAT7, it does exactly what it's supposed to do. So I'm very happy with that. All right, back to the charter cable, this time running with the Category 5E Ethernet cable. And as you can see on this test, a massive disadvantage over the CAT7. I mean, it's a night and day difference for both, well, mainly for the download speed, the upload's pretty close, but. So my recommendation, if you have an older Ethernet cable and have a higher end modem, or even if you're paying for say 100 megabytes per second, I would highly recommend upgrading your cable. It's very cheap to do and, and the results as you can see are quite impressive. All right, so as we saw, fiber pretty much dominates the cable, which is to be expected. I mean, it's, you're paying for one gig both ways. And surprisingly to me, I didn't think the cables would be that big of a difference. So like I said, if you can upgrade, I would definitely do that. Um, if you can get fiber in your neighborhoods, I would highly recommend upgrading. Here I have CenturyLink, and it's $65 a month for the lifetime. Uh, if, you, if you sign up now, they will not increase it ever, so they say. Uh, Charter, I'm paying 400 megabytes per second. I'm paying uh, $70, so it's even cheaper, and I'm getting a much faster speed. Hope you enjoyed this video. Please hit the thumbs up and subscribe. Have an awesome day. See you all later. Bye.